Hi, I'm Walt Schulte. I'm an Applications Engineer at Agilent Technologies. I'm excited today to introduce the PXA Signal Analyzer with real-time spectrum analysis. To do this, we're going to measure a frequency hopping, low-duty cycle radar signal and compare the traditional swept spectrum to the real-time spectrum analysis mode. And you'll see how the signal really jumps out. This S-band acquisition radar is particularly challenging to measure because each of seven successive pulses are spaced 10 MHz apart. Additionally, the radar uses a fast raster scan with low side lobe levels and a 1% duty cycle. First, we'll try to measure this signal in swept mode, and then we'll switch to our real-time spectrum analyzer mode. Let's get to our test setup. We've got an MXG vector signal generator and a PXA with real-time spectrum analysis. This is available on all PXAs with 160 megahertz bandwidth option, and it's also available as an upgrade. So now let's make the measurement. Traditional swept spectrum analyzers only display signal power when the sweeping local oscillator is in band. If we wish to analyze a signal like frequency hopping radar pulses, we have to take many sweeps in the hopes that the analyzer local oscillator is tuned to the frequency of the radar during the pulse on time. If the analyzer LO is tuned slightly out of band, the signal power will be reported inaccurately or missed altogether. As you can see, it takes many, many sweeps of the max hold to accurately display the spectrum of this acquisition radar. At the flight test range, our problem would be compounded by the fact that the antenna bore sight is rarely pointed in our direction, resulting in yet another scan-on-scan -scan problem for our analyzer. Of course, flight testing is enormously expensive, so it's essential to measure the signal as quickly as possible. Similarly, validating radar modes in a lab is more costly the more times the spectrum must be swept. If we can increase our throughput by decreasing measurement time, we can save time and money. In order to overcome these measurement challenges, Agilent is introducing real-time spectrum analysis as an option to the PXA signal analyzer. I'll now switch to the real-time mode and show how it quickly and accurately displays the spectrum of the same frequency hopping acquisition radar at 3 GHz. Real-time mode can display both the real-time spectrum and power versus time. The real-time spectrum works by computing almost 300,000 FFTs per second on overlapping memory registers to give an industry-leading 100% probability of intercept on any signal longer than 3.57 microseconds. Additionally, it provides up to 75 dBc spurious-free dynamic range across the full 160 MHz analysis bandwidth an excellent noise floor performance of minus 157 dBm per hertz at X-band. The power versus time trace, similar to a zero span measurement, allows you to see antenna patterns as they scan past our analyzer. It can also detect pulses of widths down to 5 nanoseconds. Real-time spectrum analysis yields quick and accurate spectra of advanced frequency hopping radars at the flight test range and in the lab where traditional swept spectrum analysis falls short. Agilent's PXA with real-time spectrum analysis provides industry-leading bandwidth, probability of intercept, dynamic range, and frequency range for difficult measurements like those we've shown today. Real-time is available on all new and existing PXAs with 160 MHz bandwidth as a software upgrade. For more information, please visit the links on your screen or contact your field engineer. Thanks for watching.